inside your home, outside your home. How about around the pool? These are great items being brought to you by Barbara King. These are the faux moss and stone indoor outdoor animal. And we have some incredible choices for you this morning. This is on a feature price of $26.92. And it's a perfect opportunity to just add something a little bit special, maybe a conversational piece to your garden. But joining me now is Janet Heitman. Good morning. Hi, good morning. You are here with the Barbara yes. King team. You help her design some the things that we have here at QVC and you're a big part of her her, her um, flower shop yes down We're in uh, Wayne Pennsylvania Pen Pen Wayne Pennsylvania yeah I always say Pennsylvania but sometimes people don't know where yeah. it is and that's Valley Floor Forage Flower Shop yeah exactly. so tell me a little bit more about this we have three options this morning we are we have four, four. options yeah yes so we have the owl which has been the most popular oh, he's so since sweet it's come out and I can see why she's, yeah. she's just sitting there just ready to be brought home exactly then we have our little hedgehog, which is cute. I love that um, that this is. It looks almost like a rock. I, right. It actually fooled me standing here because I only saw three because I didn't see all the faux moss because the moss is on the other side. Duh. What a great decor piece. Yes. Then we have the uh, rooster, mm -hmm. and then we have the frog. You mentioned earlier that the frog would be great to put like near a path, like a po uh, pathway. Yeah, maybe? definitely. Or a pool. Yeah, definitely. He's so sweet. I love the whimsy that he would add to any patio or any garden. Um, so I just think he's absolutely fabulous and he's a nice size mm -hmm. um, so and he's real subs got a real substantialness to him so he's weighted he's not going to blow away and it's really the this is magnesium and moss and uh, resin but it just gives him a, a nice weight you can hear how heavy they are on the sure. bottom here mm -hmm. um, so I just think they're great conversation pieces for any space that you have even in your home I would definitely put the rooster inside the home oh absolutely I think if it's in your kitchen um, on an island if you have a round tray and you set him in the center with a candle, I just think it would add a lot of conversation to your guests and just be a fun, whimsy touch to put in your kitchen. So. And I think adding greenery, I know when I've added maybe a small plant or anything mm -hmm. that just has green in the kitchen, our kitchen is mainly like grays and white, mm -hmm. it really adds that great pop. And it is fun when it's something interesting and fun to look at. Like I would even put the owl like in a corner. Yes. I could see him or the, like, like you said, the rooster is perfectly appropriate. Right, absolutely. Also, I think the Garden, or the owl would also be good in um, your beds where the other animals might be. I know they do oh, yeah. deter from uh, birds coming in. Um, if you had a window box, you could certainly set them in there. If that cardinal keeps coming back to your window, sure. um, that would definitely be something to do. And then the hedgehog is just, they're so popular right now. Uh, we do have customers who come in, their children have them as pets. Um, so this is really fun. You could put this anywhere in the house, but also just outside in your garden and people are gonna take a look at that and find it so interesting because of the texture we were able to add in the stone as well as the substantialness to this one as well. He's just so cute and his little nose is just so sweet right there. So I think he's really fun. Well, and the faux moss, uh, truthfully, the very first time I saw these, I actually thought that they were real. Yeah. I did not realize that it was faux until I looked at, you know, our our, um, our information on the screen, right. I thought that they were real from first glance. Right. They look very substantial. They're a beautiful piece. But here's the great thing. Moss takes forever to grow, from my understanding. And hard and to grow in the right spaces. Super <laughs> yeah, and, there's, and it's super difficult to grow. It's super difficult to like put together. Yes. And this is already done for you. And especially mm -hmm. if you like situate it in certain places, nobody will really ever know. No. So this is, they will not know. They'll come up to it and think that it is actual moss. I um, Because it is done <laughs> so well. It and is. that's what I love about it. It's the right color of green. Um, when you see the moss growing in the hidden spaces in your garden, um, I think this blends in beautifully with it. So I think they're just fantastic. Now you have four choices this morning, mm -hmm. and the most popular and the most limited this morning is starting on the owl. Mm -hmm. This guy has been really talked about. And how many did you say we have, Tori? We have fewer than two dozen of these. So oh, if you want great. the owl, I encourage you, don't walk, run to your app <laughs> or qvc.com, place that phone call 1-800-345-1515, because this guy won't probably last very long. Oh, There's less than, two, than a few dozen. Here we have the rooster. 
I also skipped over the hedgehog. So these two we're going to talk about together because they're okay. right next to each other. Yeah. And then last but not least, our option over here is the frog. He's my personal favorite. Yeah. I'm not. I, I just I could see putting him right by my door on either yeah. side. Yep. To your point, right next to a pool would be super fabulous. Yes. Now I do want to ask. They're indoor outdoor. They are. So they're... does that mean that they can sustain elements? They can. Perfect. They definitely can. They can withstand the sun. They can be in the cold. They're not going to be fragile or break. So they are definitely going to survive all elements. Which well, which is great because how many times do you think you put things out and you're like, is this going to survive? Is it going to last? But right. Barbara King always brings us these really great pieces. But right. what the what's the real showstopper about this is it's faux fur. Yeah. So it's. You don't have to worry about the maintaining it. You don't have to water it. You don't have to trim it or you take don't. care of it, right? No, it's really fun. You just put it in your garden. You put it in your kitchen, wherever you decide to put it. There it is. It'll add that conversation piece that you're looking for, another texture in your garden. Um, so they're ready to go out of the box. No maintenance with them at all. Now, Barbara King is really known for bringing us these great pieces for not yes. only our decor, but our gardens as well. Yes. And the fact that we can use this inside and outside, like I'm thinking maybe even the office. Yeah. I've gone in and seen people's um, uh, shelving units decorated. Right. I think this would be a great piece. Or maybe you want to buy a gift. It's Mother's Day is coming up. Yeah. So if you have an avid gar gardener in your life or someone who wants to add a little piece of decor, right. one of these would be amazing. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. I think of this on a children's bookshelf because oh. Very Kids cute. do love the hedgehogs right now, and they are so popular. So I definitely think when you've talked about that Papa Green, I think that's so important in your space to just bring that brightness in, no matter what color you're decorating with. I think they're, it's a really good color to bring into your space. So, so the owl has sold out. Oh, if yay. you were able to grab one of those, congratulations. Very cute. But if you're still shopping, there are three options left. We have the hedgehog, very super cute and fabulous. Mm -hmm. We have that great rooster, and then we have the frog. This is on $26.92, you can bring that home. M60523, coming from Barbara King, bringing us those fabulous items of decor for inside and outside our home. Janet, thank you so thank much for you. coming today. Thank you for having so me. So much fun, I love getting all the decor tips. Yes. Now, coming up a little bit later in the show, we have this